Now, when you <clears throat> take yourself through the steps, rather than a recording doing it, yeah. it has the added benefit of rallying your will. Because when you're delivering the instruction to yourself, that's an act of will. If you're having a recording do it for you, you don't the need wills. it. So it's intensifying your capacity to exercise will, which is intention. Yeah. And the other three, attention, memory, and imagination. So to deliver it to yourself is like lifting weights in a way. <laughs> nice. Resistance training. You're developing these capacities in yourself in an additional way from the way you, the changes you get just from doing the steps. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. In addition, when you're delivering it to yourself, you're pulling the steps from non-existence into existence. Is that plain? The meaning plain to you when I say that? It does. Can you say that again? Yeah, when, when, you, when you're delivering the steps to yourself instead of a recording, yeah. you're pulling things out of from latency or non-existence yeah. into existence. Yeah. That's a very yeah, I can understand useful, that. That's a very useful ability because all creativity involves capturing emerging ideas from non-existence. They emerge into existence and then you capture them and you capture them as memories. Yeah. Where they stick around. Yeah. And then you can apply them into creating tangible things. So in this case, the tangible things... It froze again. Yeah. yeah, just froze again. Tangible, you got to that. Yeah. Tangible things. Yeah. So what I did with these procedures is an example of it. I The first one that I pulled into existence, or that was delivered to me and I captured, was the gold key release. Yeah. I captured it, and then I kept working with it to refine the wording and structure of it, storing that in memory. And then I did recordings and write-ups, making it tangible and durable. Yeah. Yeah. So, so this process of apprehending something from imagination and apprehending it, capturing it, and making it tangible is the stream of all innovation, all creativity. Okay. The arts, technology, you name it. Anything where there are emerging conditions, emerging developments. Yeah. Undergoes that process. I suspect that most people, maybe everybody, has what they would call great ideas from time to time, <laughs> but they don't capture them. Yeah. And they evaporate. Yes. Those who do capture them. Yeah become visionary creatives yeah. and in some you know in one domain technology you had someone like steve jobs i was thinking that yeah yeah right he just captured one thing after another and yeah. generated apple computer elon musk same thing yeah that's in the technology what do they call it sector technology yeah. sector in yeah. the arts it's perfectly obvious that all the great composers, say the yeah. ones of classical or romantic music. music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Same thing. How do you think Beethoven yeah. wrote the Ninth Symphony? It was like yeah. he would hear it and he would capture it and then he would render it tangible in his scores that he was, the original scores that he was writing down. He's calling it composing. The composition already yeah. occurred. Yeah. Mozart said this himself. He said that the pieces were, were already written in his mind before he set a note down on paper. Yeah, I heard that, yes. Yeah. Okay. Same thing. It's the capacity to capture to what's capture. emerging. Now, people don't do that. Why? They don't have mastery of their attention. Their mind yeah. wanders. They don't have the intention to capture it. Yeah. Because the only intentions they've developed are those that they had to develop for their livelihood, say, 
yep. or for certain relationships. So they have a disciplined attention as a faculty that's broadly applicable. They just exercise it in particular ways. Yeah. They're, yeah. Not, they're not used to apprehending these emergents, and so their memory isn't disciplined. And their imagination, they're confusing largely with memory. They think that, oh, I can imagine my phone number. Well, that's remembering it. That's not imagining. Yeah. Imagination is characterized by originality. Yeah. Think, think Walt Disney. Mm. See? Yeah. And that was one of his favorite key words, imagination. Yeah. So yeah. there is a vast potential yeah. for humanity, for human beings, if they just turn on the four faculties or the factors yep. of intelligence and start downloading the stream of yeah. wealth. Yeah. No, I, I, yes, I agree. I mean, because I'm in a position where I'm create. It's creativity, being a musician, and so that's mm -hmm. I do. You know, that's a lot of that is creativity, which is great. So that's natural. That's there. Obviously, I've to, I've had to work of it over the years, mm -hmm. but as you're saying as well, I've, I've, lots of people have ideas. I don't mean they are great ideas to themselves. Mm -hmm. I'm always, I'm constantly always writing things down. I might not. It might. It might seem a great idea. It'll be fine. Then I might. As <laughs> that's just talking about attention or intention, and then I've covered, obviously eventually I'll get round to see if I can, that can happen, if that situation can happen. But obviously I can understand you can lose a lot, can't you? If, like you said, I, I suppose a situation comes up where you say, oh, I thought about that a couple of years ago. Why didn't I do that? Then you know what I mean? There's, there's things that tend to come up and, and <sighs> alter your awareness. Isn't this, that's what you're saying, isn't it, really? Not to capture is to... It's to make it present, I suppose, isn't it? It's there con continuously. That's right. It's to stabilize it. Yeah. Yeah. Got Yeah. Yeah. So what happens if you don't capture it is that a shift occurs in you just by ordinary moment-to-moment -moment living in which you lose the frame of mind that was the receiver for that emergent idea and if you don't capture it at least some of it yeah it's going to be very difficult to go back and recapture it it has evaporated your receiver is no longer tuned to that station got yeah so you've got to capture at least some of it if you yeah. capture some of it and you work it you can pull the rest of it back into existence it's not easy if you don't capture much of it. it. It's going to require very deliberate application of intention to capture the rest of it. Yeah. But if you, if you capture enough of it, the parts you captured will remind you of the other parts. You bring right. it all into existence. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's quite a that's quite a, a thing to observe, isn't it? Really, For, you know what I mean. I know you've observed that. Uh,